What's going on everybody? This is Patrick with Mid 10 Outdoors. This little trip just come up out of nowhere. Um, so uh, we'll see what happens. I got everything, threw everything together and I forgot my camera mic. So we're going to have to deal with onboard mics for the whole day. Sorry. Um, so I'm gonna talk as much, talk up as best I can, and we'll go from there. All right, guys, stay tuned. We gotta get to where we're going. Got about an hour and forty minute drive, so we'll see. guys so I've made it to Laurel Hill Wildlife Refuge area and I'm coming up on this it's moving pretty good but it's concrete underneath there over to there what I want to look at is the map to see if I want to go across this back out and around um, I don't know, it's probably two, three inches deep, but I think the Titan can do that, but I'm solo. Huh. Now, I don't know, I have seen this on another video. I did a little bit of video research, and I don't know if I've seen this one or is another one but I saw a Subaru go through it so I'm thinking the Titan's a lot heavier than that Subaru was it's flowing good but it's not rolling it's just a good steady flow but I don't know if anything I want is on that side so I'm gonna look around a little bit make a decision because I can always turn around here and go back up and out we come down good ways um, you can't even see it from here, but the hills are back up over there. We came down. I came down. So, we're just out exploring today. So, I made the judgment call of turn around and go back up. Um, I saw another road back up on the, the hill that led off another direction. But I'm still way north of where I was headed. Uh, intentionally so what I may do there was another road that led off it may be the one I was looking for actually this one's something kind of different um, but I'm just gonna ease way my way back up this hill show you real quick it's it's pretty decent hill <laughs> Right up there actually is where I was. Okay, so actually it's a pretty good hill we're fixing to go back up, but it's nothing bad. Um, nothing this I, I can't do. But um, I'm just out exploring today. I had nothing to do. Um, so 
buddy of mine, Chris Melton, uh, I went to high school with. He mentioned this area, so I thought, well, shoot, I'll. Well, I said, you ain't gonna do, look it up, see what it's like. And I said, okay. I know it's hunting lens, but who says, or, or, you know, normal outdoor guy can't come out here and just ride around a little bit. That's what I'm done. Um, this would be real pretty in the summer. All the trees and the green and everything. Or be pretty infested with mosquitoes too. But that creek was moving pretty good. I, I could have done it. I wish I had somebody else with me, another vehicle. That way, if you know something bad happened, gone wrong, I had another vehicle. But that's why you don't take the risk if you don't feel like it's worth it. Let me show you over here. Look at this down here. I mean, this valley. It's gorgeous over here. I always knew this area being fluff, what I thought was fairly flat, but I mean, this is a heck of a hill right here, hillside that we're coming up. Look back down in there. Hey, right, well, I'll bring you back once we get to this other road. Um, really neat area. And I'm seeing some roads that maybe next time, like this road right here. Hang on a second. My map is done. This is not on my map. It's down here. It's blocked off anyway, but it is not on my map. On Gaia or anything I've got on. So. And I had to turn Zillion on because I lost service. I'm on SOS mode, so. Alright, we'll be back. Okay, so we're on the road. I think it's called, <laughs> like I said that, I think it's called Laurel Hill Road, actually. We were on CC Road. Once again, we're up here on these valleys, but it looks like to me it might go down. I don't know. But uh, it's a loop, so we're going to do this loop, and then we'll drop further south and find what it was I was looking for. But uh, none of these roads are anything... Uh-oh. <laughs> I say that, and it, uh, it changes. Eh, it's the same hard pack I've been hitting. All right, so we're going to continue down on this one. Um, both sides of me go down in the valleys. You can see that. But uh, pretty neat area. But you'll see what I'm talking about here in a little bit. i got another area, a little spot we're going to go to and check out. Um, so continue on. It looks like we may be going down. Let's see what happens. Okay, fun fact, that road actually goes to Natchez Trace Parkway. Um, I'm sitting there looking at it on the, on the map. So if I was to take this road back, there's actually a parking area, dirt road, and um, that's Nat Natchez Trace Parkway right there. I think... This was where I was at earlier. Um, so it would come out right there. If I had gone across the creek, it, th this is where it would come out eventually. It's back at this particular road. So we're going to continue on. 
How'd you like my little creek crossing? <laughs> um, I didn't mind doing that one. That was a hell of a hill climb. But uh, we're going to come back around this road. And we'll join back up with CC Road and probably come out. And then I may drop down uh, main roads till I get to that. Possibly. Well, think about it. That's not where I was wanting to go. I need that. So anyway, we'll look at this a little bit as we're driving. I say we. It's me. I'll look at that a little bit more as I'm driving. Um, so stay tuned. Okay. So just got through talking to a fella. He said this is just for fishing. And that is just for fishing. And he talked like they didn't want you here unless that's what you were doing is fishing. So I don't know. But the little office that's here is not open to ask. So I'm going to do the right thing and um, go down this little dirt, dirt gravel road, goes to picnic tables and stuff. And I don't have any alcohol, so we should be good. We're going to see where it goes. Um, but they got picnic tables and stuff here. I think you'd be able to at least enjoy this part he thought like it was against the rules to even be here if you're not fishing i was like what that sounds weird anyway let's take a look at what we've got so well this dead ends right here i think yeah we're going dead end right here huh Make mental note of that. But, uh, okay. Now I'm going to turn around anyway. Right here. And. But it's a pretty area right through here. And I guess if you were, you lived in this area, this would be a cool place to come and back into any trees um hang out fish and you know that kind of thing for the day this would be kind of cool a little too cool to me for me to be fishing but i guess there's a bunch of people here fishing boats um but he said you can't and where i was wanting to go was the dam and he said you can't get there and i was like okay crap so I guess we uh, we'll see where we can go from here, and uh, this might be concluding the video before it's over with. So we'll see here in a minute. Okay, so I came on back further. I came back out of where that little picnic area is, and I'm coming back through here. Man, you're right on the water. Look at this. This is cool. But you can back up and fish here. I mean that's that's cool. I'm you know if I get back into fishing this year, that that would be cool. Right. So it just goes back up that hill. Okay. But that is a beautiful lake right there. And the dam's just right down yonder. I don't know how far we can go. We'll find out. I mean but you're right, man, if that lake was up bad, <laughs> you'd be in it. Now, I'm sure if Chris sees this, he'll tell me, you know, some things that I'm sure this floods pretty easily. As close as it is to the lake, you can see right there. It looks like we're driving right in it. But I've seen some roads that, well, no, not really, it's not a road. I've seen some other stuff that was pretty cool that when things become different and you'll know what I mean one day uh, we would have gone on through hey how you doing <laughs> guys literally fishing right there um, I'm just seeing where the road goes if I have to turn around I have to turn around Isn't that right that's what we do uh, 
No, no, he's just fishing off the bank, I bet. And he was talking about, you're only supposed to be here if you have a fishing license. I think I still have my fishing license on my phone. So, technically, I've got my fishing license. Look at that. That's pretty wild. All right, this road keeps going, so I keep going. There's somebody pulled up. I'm guessing they're fishing somewhere right in here. Maybe. Maybe doing other things. I'm not one to judge. But, uh, just keep on going and see where it goes. All right, so this, actually, the road U-turns right here and goes back out the way I came. Oh. But, uh, what I want to do is... It's just one of the peninsulas right here on the lake. It shoots up in here. You see. Pretty lake. Really is. But it's TWRA. So I know rules are different for TWRA versus state versus federal. Or, I mean, good lord. You have, have to have several books in your vehicle to keep up with everything you're doing. But uh, I do I did check. I do have my fishing license. Now, I would have to make sure that it's good for this lake, but I would think it is. But that's pretty me. So I uh, zoom down as far as I go. This is just one of the peninsulas that come up in here. The main lake goes back that way towards the dam, and you can't get to the dam. That's what I was wanting to do. Damn it. Anyway. So, let's cruise back up out. What time is it? It's 3 o'clock. Yeah, two hours back home. So, I need to think about that. This may be the day. This may be the end. It's a pretty area though. <laughs> so I guess for now, I'm going to call it a day. Uh, you know, tight. Going to head back toward, back north, back towards home. But uh, it's been a good afternoon to ride in the ride where I'm riding um, may have some more stuff for you at the end all right guys that's it for this one I appreciate you watching Chris thanks you for the suggestion or tell me about this thought I'd just drive down today and look at it and see hope you uh, found your way to the dirt devil maybe later down the road we can meet up with you and you can go with us Maybe meet up. We can go somewhere. Fun, fun. But uh, that's it for this one, guys. I appreciate you watching. From Laurel Hill Wildlife Management Area. This is Mid-10 Outdoors. We'll see you on the next one. Be prepared.